everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Miss Lauren Lee 11 and today I'm going to be showing you an alternative to hair grease. It's either yes or no, you like hair grease or you don't like hair grease. I've had a lot of yes, you do like hair grease, but there are some that don't like hair grease and I want to give you guys a chance as well. I want to give you an alternative and today's alternative which I'm going to be using is castor oil. So this is nothing but castor oil. It's literally just cold pressed castor oil. And the reason why I'm going to give you an alternative, guys, because as you may be aware, which my hair doesn't mind, a lot of hair greases, or the majority, or maybe all of the hair greases that I've seen, contain petrolatum and they also contain mineral oil. Now, I know some people may not be a fan of those ingredients. My hair, for some reason, thrives with those ingredients. I don't, I don't know, it's just my hair. So, as I said, I'm gonna show you the castor oil. Now, what I like about this particular brand, it's got a thick consistency, which resembles a light hair grease to me. It's kind of sticky, and it's quite, it's quite thick for an oil. So, what it will do is seal in the moisture, as well as promote hair growth. Castor oil contains a fatty acid, which helps with inflammation on the scalp, which then in turn helps promote hair growth. So as you can see, my hair is freshly washed, but it's dried immensely because it is quite humid. So all I'm gonna do before I put the castor oil on my hair and seal in any moisture, because as you can see, my hair is not moisturized right now, I'm going to apply a new leave conditioner from Primark, which is for Curl and Define. Um, I don't usually use a leave-in conditioner, but for times like these when my hair is pretty dry, I think it's necessary to use a leave-in because otherwise I'm just sealing in the dryness. I would advise just for extra added moisture, maybe spritz your hair first before you apply the leave-in, but I don't have a water bottle to hand, so I'm just, as I said, I'm just gonna apply my leave-in, because it is a liquid of some sort. It has a nice slip. I think I might have to do a review on this one, guys. Okay, so that's dampened my hair enough. So all I'm gonna do is detangle. So once I've detangled that bit nicely, as you can see I can run my fingers through, I'm going to apply my castor oil as I would do with my hair grease. So I'm going to apply it on my parting because it's imperative that we get it on the scalp. You can obviously use the black castor oil. The reason why I'm not using that, I think the smell for me is a bit too pungent. This one has a slight scent but it's more so odourless. So I'm gonna do my hair in twos, guys, but I'm literally just making sure I coat my scalp throughout. And now I'm gonna seal this section. I'm gonna start with the ends. So again, a little goes a long way, guys. It almost has a syrup texture, consistency. Nicely moisturized and sealed. So hard with you, I don't know why. Believe me, boy, I've tried, tried. When you're near me, my heart fills up with butterflies. And then you leave me speechless. My world turned upside down. you won't 
don't go and break my heart Break my heart, don't break it now Remember it's the only one I've got The one I've got, don't break my heart One thing I will say as well, guys, my hair doesn't feel greasy. Uh, not necessarily saying hair grease makes you feel, your hair feel greasy, but I mean, <laughs> the clue is in the name, hair grease. But this doesn't make my hair feel greasy or tacky. It feels slightly sticky when you first apply it in your hand, but other than that, it's fine. Now, guys, I could just go out with my hair like this and just let it air dry. I don't think it will get tangled. I mean, I can do a wash and go with this castor oil if you want, but today I'm just gonna plait my hair. As well as my scalp, I've also got it on my edges and at the nape of my neck. My hair feels super moisturized after that dry patch I just showed you. Let me just quickly show you what this looks like. So I'm not trying to smooth down my edges or anything and that's another thing as well guys because of the consistency it does get your flyaways to lay down okay so i've got hair time and what i want to do is make sure my ends are completely sealed a little bit more on the end plus it gets your curls popping as well because it's pretty self-explanatory i'm just going to go ahead and do the other side so you can see the difference moisturized just say that you won't go and break my heart break my heart don't break it now remember it's the only one i've got the one i've got don't break my heart turned 
turned upside down Just say that you won't go and break my heart Break my heart, don't break it now Remember it's the only one I've got The one I've got, don't break my heart There you have it guys, a nice, simple, quick, healthy alternative to hair grease. So if you like this video guys, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. I want to get to, let's say, I want to get to a thousand likes. Let's get a thousand likes for this video. Yeah, let's, let's do that. Alright guys, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Bye.